Bunions are a real pain. Millions of people deal with the common foot problem. News 5's Jessica Taloni shows us a new surgery that's getting patients back on their feet faster. For years, surgery options always meant a long, tough recovery. Now an innovative microsurgery is allowing patients to walk right out of the hospital. For years, Katherine Cobb Ryan put off bunion surgery because the mom and actress worried it would leave her in even more pain. I was always in pain, but you ignore it. A bunion is a bony bump that forms on the bottom of the big toe, making it painful to walk and wear shoes. When I realized, oh my gosh, I need to get this done, I googled new bunion surgery yet? Question mark. And up came this article. Orthopedic surgeon Ator Volcano at Mount Sinai West is the first in the U.S. to perform this procedure. He says the new minimally invasive surgery takes less time and is far less painful. What's revolutionary about it is that it's done through extremely tiny incisions. And so that, is, that allows to cut on recovery time substantially. During the operation, Dr. Volcano makes a two to three millimeter incision then uses a live x-ray to shave and realign the bone. I cut the bones at this level, I shifted it over and made it straight, and then I put a titanium pin inside into each one of the bones to keep that in position. This is Catherine's left foot before and after surgery. She had both feet done six weeks apart and says she walked out of the hospital with no pain and was off crutches in a week. I'm going to be able to buy more shoes. <laughs> It's really hard to find shoes. And she's looking forward to getting back to exercising and skiing, which her bunions forced her to give up. The new procedure can also be used to treat other foot problems like hammer toe. Dr. Volcano says most patients do not need any pain medication after the surgery. I'm Jessica Taloni for WKRG News 5.